YouTube, Kami Gecko here, and for today's video, I'm gonna share a little obsession I have with you guys. And no, it's not the green, black, and white. Okay, am I kidding? That is an obsession. I love green, black, and white together, and red, and blue, and gold, and galaxy, as well as colors that I like. Okay, all right. So today's video, I'm a bit excited because I grew my own crystals. My crystal. So here it is. So you can see there's like red and like a green and like a little bit of white here in the end, some clear, and you know it's got some sky blue. See, it's like it's like really really pretty. This is my first crystal that I grew. I'm proud of it. Okay. All right. Second crystal is extremely delicate. Right, that thin shot, it's this. Like, can I get this to focus? There we go. As you can see, all these tiny little sparkle things, it's all little crystals. Like, even there in the gap, like, we might not miss that line, full of crystals. And on the other side, it's like crystal moss. It's so pretty. Like, I love it a lot. You know? Okay. So I'm going to just set that aside where it can't be damaged. All right. My next crystals I have are in here. So I'm going to show you guys this one here. This was growing with the crystal moss, but this grew more of like a lump. As you guys can see, it's really, it's really tiny, but it's really pretty as well. Like really, really pretty. Got like white and some blue, and it's really pretty. Okay, the next one was growing in a separate container, so it's here as it here. Okay, ah, that's better. Okay, so yeah, it's got like some blue on it, it's got some yellow, some dark green, a little few black spots here and there. It's really pretty. Okay, the other one is similar to that, but it's like a more elongated shape. So it looks like a carpet, like a little greeny, blue, shiny carpet. It's freaking gorgeous. And this is actually really freaking pretty. Like, look at this. All those sharp, light sky bluey shards. Freaking beautiful. Like, see, it looks like lace. Like, you can see it right through it. I mean, how deadly does this look? It's got all these little sharp, sharp pointy ones. There's a big one over there. Quite a bit, you know, and I mean the color itself is like, sort of like an icy blue color. And then there's a smaller one. See, there's a big, big shard. I mean, can you imagine if this was Your nails. Guys, think about it. Crystal nails. That is a trend I haven't seen anyone do. Crystal nails, like actual crystals, but on your nails. Well, it can be like some demonic version of Elsa. Oh, look, there's a little shard right there. I'll try and pick it up. Here we go. Just one little shard. Freaking sharp ass shard. Okay, and here's a more flatter one. But like, freaking amazing. Like, so what actually happened was, I was mixing the solution for that, um, this very, for this thin piece here, I was mixing the solution. And what actually happened was, I'll show you guys here using this lead. So this is the lead, right? So, the crystals, it almost broke it. The crystals were growing like this in the lead, right? All those dark spots is actually residue. 
that's residue from the crystals itself, from growing them, right? So the liquid, didn't, it, the container didn't have like a cardboard or paper sheet over it with a small hole in the middle. It had, that paper sheet or cardboard or lid or cover on the sides actually prevents the crystals from falling over because crystals is evaporation. That's how they work. So as it evaporated, the moisture, the ones that were growing and hanging off the sides were a bit wet and damp. So they started growing and the liquid on the outside started dripping and then thus, uh, this really delicate, beautiful piece was like growing like this. So as it was dripping off, it was dripping and then the liquid dropped and because it gets really cold, your oven at nighttime. So on the windowsill, the, like the windowsill is metal, so that gets cold really, really quickly at night. So the liquid actually traveled and started to spread. And then it had these big like blobby trails on the outside. So I thought, let me just leave it because it might actually end up looking pretty, which it actually did. I mean, it was freaking shiny. Like, look at this. This is beautiful. It almost looked like a piece of metal, like a metallic sheet. But it's delicate and very delicate. You know, I'm going to be editing this anyway, so y'all can like walk past, make noise. Okay, there's two spe spectators walking that way, being all suspect-like. But anyway, so that's pretty much how this long shard started growing. Was pretty much from crystal liquid that was dripping off the sides. And that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. Um, anyway, uh, guys, if you like my video on these crystals and how weird they are, give this video a like, subscribe, comment, share, and stay awesome. Because you guys are awesome. You're amazing followers. Stay awesome.